and welcome back. Now, we'll start with a story I had a chance to talk about a little bit earlier today with uh, David Knight on the Alex Jones radio show headline, The Wi-Fi in Your Home Can Track Your Moves Like Xbox Connect. Any wireless devices in the home, like a phone or laptop, could be used as a signal source. WeSee could then enable a number of exciting applications. For instance, a user could control the music with a simple gesture. Other devices could be controlled across the room. And, you know, I, as I said on the Alex Jones radio show with David Knight, uh, I definitely see how these things could be helpful. That's a really cool graphic. I don't know who made that. Um, I see how these things could be helpful to people who have disabilities and so forth. But you got to keep in mind, you know, the larger aspect of this stuff. Like, as I said earlier, uh, you know, these things can be able to track not only the movements in your home, but the number of people in your home. And I gave the example, if you live in an apartment like I do, uh, you know, you probably have some neighbors who got more than a, people, a few people who probably aren't on their lease, lease living in that apartment. So, you know, the next time the, the uh, leasing agent or whoever wants to come by, you know, all they have to do is check your recent uh, utility bill and say, hey, you've had about 10 people living in this apartment. How do you know that? Because I've been checking on your Xbox Connect. I've been checking on your local Wi-Fi system. As the guy said in the video, all you need is just a basic Wi-Fi connection. They can even pull feeds off of laptops and things like smartphones. So I definitely uh, would be aware of things like that because I'm, I'm done with Xbox. You know, I play a game every now and then, but I'm not doing all the Xbox Connect and PlayStation and Nintendo get on that stuff. I'm done with that too. We'll move on now to some other news. EPA accused of singling out conservative groups amid IRS scandal. So we're not even done with the IRS scandal and we already have, you know, an another agency allegedly in on the activities. The allegations concern the Environmental Protection Agency, which is being accused of trying to charge conservative groups fees while largely exempting liberal groups. The fees apply to the Freedom of Information Act request. Allegedly, the EPA waived them for liberal groups far more than they did conservative ones. The allegations are under investigation by the House Energy and Commerce Committee and the House Oversight Committee and Government Reform Committee. So it's just more of what we've been seeing, you know, the IRS. Everybody either quit, retired, moved to a different uh, position, or just invoked their Fifth Amendment. And now we see the EPA uh, allegedly doing some similar actions. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. And this is just a day after we reported on how the AP said that they were uh, discriminated against or asked to pay $1 million to the Labor Department for a FOIA request. You know, we're going to charge you a million dollars just to get some documents. Like I said, that's. That's like charging, uh, being charged a fee by a librarian for helping you find a book. But I guess it made sense to them. But then uh, I believe the Labor Department said, oh, we're sorry that we actually said that, but we would have took your money if you gave it to us. Now we'll move on to this. Are you Bradley Manning? High profile Americans take to YouTube to back noble petition. Now in this video, you'll see many famous Americans showing their support for uh, Mr. Manning. Manning, 25 could spend the rest of his life in prison if convicted of aiding and abetting the enemy by leaking military cables to WikiLeaks. U.S. military prosecutors have asserted that Manning put his own agenda above national security and that by releasing cables, most notably the murder video depicting an American helicopter opening fire on civilians, he jeopardized Americans in the field of battle. Now, I'm sure there was some very sensitive information linked uh, leaked by uh, Mr. Manning, and he has admitted some wrongdoing, and, you know, I accept that. You know, he admits that, hey, I did some stuff wrong. I released some information I should have, but that one video in particular, if you're not familiar with that, you can go type in on YouTube, uh, helicopter shoots cameraman or, you know, whatever it was. Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, that's it right there. So, and what this is, a helicopter opens fire on a group of gentlemen. You know, they have cameras and so forth, and then a man pulls up in a minivan, if I'm thinking of the same clip, a man pulls up in a minivan with his children in the car and the helicopter opens fire on the man's van with the children inside. And you can hear one of the soldiers in the helicopter say, well, he shouldn't have brought his kids to a war zone. The guy lives in a war zone. He, I'm, he, I'm pretty sure if he could go someplace else, he would. It's not like me in Austin. If I don't like Austin, I can move to San Antonio, you know, an hour down I-35. Like that's, that's their, that's what, how they live, man. That's what they do. And I mean, I'm saying they don't, you know, get shot up for a living. You know, that's not what I'm saying. 
I'm saying that's where they live. There's nothing else they can do about their situation. But you have these very arrogant, very cocky guys up in the helicopter shooting down that at unarmed civilians, children, and saying you shouldn't have brought your children out here. But meanwhile, the uh, the Bradley Manley Bradley Manning trial is still ongoing. Uh, I believe it was RT or, or many other people have talked about it. But I believe the article was on RT when I was looking at it. They were talking about how very few people are still covering it because I believe it started on Monday and there's a big hoopla and there's a lot of media and other people out there. And they say now, if you go there now, it's, there's pretty much nobody out there other than the essential people just to run the trial. So definitely keep Bradley Manning in your thoughts and prayers. Even if you think the guy is guilty of sin, you know, he's a whistleblower. He is trying to expose some things that did not need to be going on. You know, I'm sure there's other sensitive information out there as well. But I think a life sentence for trying to expose what I view as war crimes, at least that particular instance, is more than a little stiff. Now we'll move on now to our quote of the day, the end of our broadcast, at least for our news segment. This by Prince Bernhard. It is difficult to re-educate people who have been brought up on nationalism to the idea of relinquishing part of their sovereignty to a supranational body. That by Prince Bernhard, a founding member of the Bilderberg Group. Pro Pure is introducing Pro One, all of your filtration in one system, portable, on the go. This is the Pro One by Pro Pure. You wanted it, you got it. No more do you have two or three filters to just reduce sodium fluoride. You have a system that cuts out the sodium fluoride and up to 95% of hydrofluorosilicic acid. Advanced manufacturing technology combines silver impregnated white ceramic with new Aquamedics advanced media for removal of fluoride and other heavy metals all in one filter element. It cuts out the acid derivative of fluoride. It is the only one that does it and out of the gates we have it discounted at 10% off with promo code WATER. This is the only system that in one unit helps reduce or remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, ammonia and chlorine, hydrofluorosilicic acid, the most common form of fluoride not covered by other fluoride filter brands, and sodium hexafluorosilicate. This is a revolution against the tyrants. They love putting the toxic acid base of fluoride into your water. They love the fact that it's an adjuvant supercharging the trace Prozac in the water and the hormones and the other chemicals. By cutting out fluoride, you cut out the turbocharger in all the poison being artificially introduced into your body. This is what I use. It's a win-win. You get a high-quality product at the lowest price. You support the InfoWar. Get your Pro Pure with the new Pro One filter today at InfoWarStore.com or by calling 888-253-3139.